G'day, trendsetters. This is the Linsky Pro GR 6 4 titanium gravel bike, the Chattanooga, Tennessee gravel bike. The Linsky Pro GR gravel bike is handmade in Chattanooga, Tennessee, and is the second Linsky titanium gravel bike I have reviewed here on gravelcyclist.com. The first being the GR250, which has been slightly superseded by the GR260. But you can check out the uh, details of that review in the description below. I've had the Linsky Pro GR in my possession for some time, and I've had plenty of opportunities to rack up a lot of miles slash kilometers, mostly in the southeast in the United States, including one or two gravel races. The Linsky Pro GR is designed for 700C, like this wheel set here, or 650B, the smaller wheel size, but your spec will depend on the group set or wheels that you order from Linsky whenever you order your bicycle, or you can also order the frame and fork by itself. So without further delay, it's time to talk about the finer details of the Linsky Pro GR and how the bicycle rides. The Linsky Pro GR is the first and possibly only hand-built 6-4 titanium gravel bike frame set. Linsky's design engineer set out to create a frame that offered strength, stiffness and comfort, including no lost power transfer and precision handling on par with the company's top tier pro-level performance bikes. Features include the standout triangular top tube and down tube designed for stiffness, stability and comfort. A tapered head tube which promises precision handling when paired with Linsky's Pro GR gravel fork. Weighing approximately 450 grams, this is the lightest full carbon gravel fork available and it includes an integrated fender mount. Helix or helix shaped chainstays to resist vertical forces and help propel the rider as the gravel road turns skyward. Big tire clearance on par with the Linsky GR260 which means at least 45 millimeters front and rear for 700C or 2.1 inches front and rear for 650B. This tire clearance comes courtesy of the Pro GR's plate style chainstay design, which also gives plenty of room for chain rings, but without extending the chainstays and thus sacrificing performance. Cable routing that accepts hydraulic or mechanical disc brakes and new for 2018, electronic shifting ready, which previously was an option. Flat mount disc brakes front and rear. All our gravel bikes are using 12 millimeter rear through axles. Uh, one of the challenges on that, if you're a metal frame builder, is dealing with rear end alignment uh, when you've just got a, a through axle going on through there. So what we developed is over here, this hole is a fixed hole, but if you come around and look on the other side, there is an, what's by definition, it's an eccentric, a non-concentric nut with a thread in it, and you can and it indexes around to pull the wheel into final perfect alignment instead of having to try to twist the frame or grind out the hole and, and re-weld and so a it, get, it, it allows us to really keep the frame in very good alignment as it leaves the factory what it also presents, and this is not so important in a road bike, but in a gravel bike or a mountain bike, you crash, you hit a rut wrong, etc., and now you've warped your wheel a little bit. What do you do? Well, with this system, you can. You can take the nut out and index it around and get your tire pulled back into alignment at least enough to finish your ride and get home and then deal with your, with your warped wheel. You really don't have that opportunity with any other gravel bike design. 27.2 millimeter seat post, and incidentally, Linsky's titanium seat post features Envy's clamping mechanism. Right style dropouts, rack mounts, and an English thread bottom bracket. And finally, this example of the Pro GR was fitted with Shimano's superb 
Altegra DI2 electronic drivetrain system with hydraulic braking. The American Classic Wide Lightning 650B wheel set, the American Classic Race 29er wheel set, the Boyd Jocassi Gravel 650B carbon wheel set, and the Atom Composites 700C carbon gravel slash cross wheel set. Paneracer Gravel King 650B tubeless tires in SK and regular versions in various widths. Paneracer Gravel King SK 700C in 35mm and WTB Resolutes in 650B and 700C both measuring 42mm. Linsky state the Pro GR will fit a 700C by 45mm tyre front and rear which proved to be accurate. As you can see in this photograph of Linsky's Pro GR fork, the specialised Renegade 29er by 1.8 inch MTB tyre fits with room to spare. Because the Pro GR inherited its rear end design from the GR260, a 45mm tyre on the rear will have plenty of room on either side. Not the first time I've mentioned this, tyre clearance is an area of bike design that some manufacturers neglect, but not so with Linsky. The Pro GR has the best tyre clearance of any titanium gravel bike on the market today. In my opinion, racing is the ultimate test of a bike's ability. Unlike a friendly training ride, you don't have the luxury of picking and choosing your perfect line in a gravel race. The Linsky Pro GR was my race bike at the 2017 Red Clay Ramble, a tough 56 mile gravel race in the heart of Georgia, USA. The race may be short by gravel standards, but there are plenty of punchy climbs to test riders and adding to the challenge, some serious summer heat. My performance at this race wasn't among my best, but the Pro GR performed beyond my expectations. Because the Pro GR is built from 6-4 titanium, a grade of titanium that is renowned for its lighter weight and stiffness, this bike puts all of a rider's power to the ground without any measurable loss through flex in places such as the bottom bracket or head tube area. The Pro GR is a full-on performance titanium gravel bike. The ride is a smidge harder than a comparable titanium bike made from the 3 slash 2.5 grade material, but not so that it will leave you beaten to a pulp. The frame still has the sweet ride that titanium is known for and will keep you comfy even over the longest of gravel rides or races. Additionally, because titanium is such a resilient material, you don't have to worry about always picking the best possible line. And I just love the look of the triangular top and down tube. The cool factor is off the chart with this bike. Linsky's new Pro GR carbon fork tracks very nicely and is a perfect match for the frame. In fact, my very first ride on the Pro GR was on a gravel loop inside the Cherokee National Forest in southeastern Tennessee. That ride featured plenty of climbs, descents, and a ton of rain. The Pro GR's stiff chassis ensures all of a rider's power is put to the pedals and drivetrain. The Pro GR may feature a smaller 68mm English thread bottom bracket shell, but it is plenty stiff and there are no annoying bottom bracket standards to worry about or creaking. On descents, the Pro GR performs exceptionally well. I rode 650B wheels during my first two mountainous rides on the bike and I was pleased with how the bike performed, especially when I took an unavoidably hard hit or two. Sure, 700C wheels do better over the bigger hits, but this bike works so well with either wheel size, even when flying down a sketchy mountain pass. Remember, 6-4 titanium is tough and durable, and the material affords a rider a certain level of forgiveness for a less than perfect descending style. The Linsky Pro GR is what I consider a full-on performance titanium gravel bike, definitely suited to someone who enjoys racing. The frame is stiff, but not overbearingly so, and it would also be a great match for a physically bigger 
or very powerful rider. With all of that said, the Pro GR isn't just about racing and would cater to the needs of a rider looking for a performance oriented titanium frame that won't break the bank. The Pro GR has rack and fender mounts and no other gravel bike of similar design unless you count the GR260 by Linsky comes close to its tire clearance. The Linsky Pro GR could possibly be the ultimate titanium gravel bike. Finally, don't forget to check out my three-part interview with Mark Linsky, CEO of Linsky Performance, and my Linsky Factory Tour video, where you can see how a bicycle such as the Pro GR is manufactured. Thanks for watching. I hope you found this review to be helpful and insightful. See you next time.